what a start that is for Ben today, you know, 87 not out. It is what, unbelievable. What are, your, what are your emotions watching that? Oh, it, it's just a hugely proud t time for the uh, for, for Frinton on Sea, the, the town itself, the club, our favourite son, Ben, and actually also for all the other local clubs around the area, a lot of whose cricketers will have played against Ben. Um, a lot of people don't appreciate that and only four year, four seasons ago he was still playing here at Frinton on Sea. So, you know, in between his time at Essex and Surrey, he came back and played for us and helped, helped us secure promotion to the East Anglian Premier League. And he's still a regular visitor to the club and a life member of the club and very much part of the fabric of, of Frinton. And, and we are just so hugely proud. And what a debut. Absolutely phenomenal. We've been up here at the club since one o'clock this morning. Um, obviously, uh, the, the champagne has been flowing a little bit uh, and we'll be up again tomorrow to watch him hopefully secure his century. Um, his brother um, also played for us. Uh, he's uh, just arrived in Sri Lanka this morning. His mother uh, left today and is arriving there tomorrow, hopefully to see him uh, uh, get his century. She's hugely proud. Um, she regrets that she couldn't see him get his cap for England. He was presented with his cap, as you know, this morning. But um, she is, is totally, you know, uh, overcome with emotion and immensely proud of her boy. And, uh, and rightly so. I mean, you know, a, a fantastic cricketer, a great human being, uh, a wonderful glove man as well. And I just hope now that if he puts in the performance we know that he can with the gloves, he'll be very, very hard to dislodge. And he should be England's test wicketkeeper for many, many years to come. And you know Ben well. I mean, you, you were telling me earlier that he's he's been here since he was six years old. Yeah. yeah. Um, did, did you ever think he would play for England? Could, did you see that potential? I, I um, Ben's Ben's history is very interesting. It was before my time at the club, but our, our coach here, Tony Stubbs, knew him from the age of six. Um, just out of shot here is our cricket nets, and his father, Peter Folks, who sadly passed away when Ben was thirteen, uh, was a Premier uh, League um, referee and also a, a, a good all-round sportsman and a teacher at, uh, a, at a local school, as was his mother, also a good sportsman. And Ben was brought up in these cricket nets and, and given the basics here at Frinton. Tony Stubbs, our coach, remembers driving him at the age of six to a, uh, a, a under seven tournament at Clacton and being hugely impressed by the fact that, you know, that he, he just totally dominated things. And it's been like that throughout his, his career. He went through Essex age groups, still playing club cricket, played for us, he played a bit for Clacton, then he came back and played for us again, and, and then got his contract to Essex. Every time Ben's been challenged, he's raised his game, he's raised the bar. And that's why, okay, people say you must be shocked by what you saw today, not really. We, 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 we knew he would put in a good performance because every time he's been challenged, he's risen to it and risen actually even above it. And um, we, 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 it's a debut we couldn't have dreamt of, but, but we're not entirely surprised. It's interesting you talk about those sex setbacks as well because, you know, let go by Essex, but he, he's responded in, in the best way possible, hasn't he? Absolutely. I think Essex must be kicking themselves, surely. I mean, you know, they, 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 didn't, they saw a long-term future in James Foster and let Ben go. Uh, he went to, to a big challenge at Surrey. He, he, he wasn't the first man for the gloves by, by any um, stretch of the imagination. He had uh, Davis and Wilson in front of him, but he had belief in himself. And uh, it's that belief, actually, probably installed here at, his, at a very young age for, from his father and by playing club cricket that has driven him all the way through and, and got him to where he is today. And also, the, the irony is that he, he might not have even been playing. If, if Johnny Bairstow had, had, had been fit, he might not have been in the team. And, and what you said earlier is interesting as well. You know, now he's got those gloves. If he performs well with that, it's going to be hard to drop him, isn't it? Well, you, you'd think so. I mean, we were actually amazed that he went out to the Ashes and, and, and England put in a dar performance last year at the Ashes and he wasn't given a chance because we knew, we, we, we knew um, that, that he would rise to the occasion. So, yeah, I think he's going to be extremely hard to dislodge now, especially if he puts in the performance with the gloves that we all know that he can. So, fingers crossed, he should be... England's long-term test, test uh, glove man. And we haven't really had one since, you could say prior, but before that, Russell, you know, and, and, and folks is of, of the same calibre as those players. And a lot of people talk about his work with the gloves. That's kind of his speciality. But today's shown that he's a, he's a fantastic batsman as well. I think people have underestimated his batting. We, we've known all about it because we've seen it, you know, uh, over the years. Uh, um, but, but, you know, without doubt, he's the best glovesman, you know, in, in England. If, if people like Alex Stewart are telling you that, then, you know, you know that it's, it's, it's pretty much true. But, yeah, fantastic. If you looked at his innings today, what timing, you know. I mean, the, the England top order went out there and threw their wickets away. 
And then you had him come in there and he just picked and chose the, the, the shots to play and just accelerated when he needed to accelerate and, and just, just basically built the innings. And he's dug England out of a huge hole there today. I'll tell you what, as, as well, you know, it's an Ashes coming up next summer on home soil. How, how amazing would that be for this club? to see Ben playing, playing for England there? Absolutely fantastic. We can't wait. I think Frinton would empty for the day. We'd all have to go and, 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 and support him. And, um, you know, I'm hoping now he stays in and a lot of us will, uh, are going out to, to the West Indies this, this winter, you know, in, in the firm hope that he'll be in the, in, still in the test setup and we'll see him play out in Barbados and places like that. Hope so. And he's not forgotten his roots here as well. You, you know, you're saying he, he comes back and, and yeah. sees how everyone was doing, and, and that's great as well, isn't it? Yeah, not not at all. He's he's very much one of the boys here. Um, he he, you know, he went to the local school, uh, Tendering Technology College. He didn't have the advantage of a uh, of a public school education with all the facilities that go there. So he had to play his 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 cricket, at, you know, at club level, and that's where he learned the basics. And that must be a huge inspiration to other local uh, lads. Who, who, who can see now that the hurdles are there, but they can be crossed. And so, you know, the average club cricketer that's looking at that must take a, a lot of pride in, in, in seeing a guy make his debut for England and, and a spectacular debut as well. And finally, how would everyone feel here if, if he does go on to make that century tomorrow? Oh, uh, yeah, the, 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 you'll hear the champagne, champagne corks popping in Norwich, I'm sure. <laughs> we, we can't wait. And, and, and uh, you know, fingers crossed. I mean, we mustn't, we mustn't jinx him. But you know, if anyone can do it, Ben folks can do it.